Corsair. Corsair is a consistent damage class with very good survivability and mobbing. You have three summons, Siege Bomber, Broadside, which can be summoned twice, and Scurvy Summons. Broadside can be paired with Firing Orders to make the ships fire faster. The general buffs are as follows. Decent Speed Infusion, Decent Sharp Eyes, Decent Combat Orders, Roll of the Dice. You also have Loaded Dice, which lets you select a number for the roll. Usually people pick 5 for damage or 6 for EXP. Jolly Roger and Maple Warrior. Corsairs have no toggles. For Corsair's main boost no trio for bossing, you want Rapid Fire, Brain Scrambler, and Majestic Presence. For secondary trio for your summons, you want Siege Bomber, Broadside, and Scurvy Summons. Lastly, your tertiary trio for training consists of Nautilus Strike, Ugly Bomb, and Eight Legs Easton. For movement, you have your Power Leap as your Flash Jump, Wings as your Up Jump and Glide, and Recoil Shot to jump backwards. Bossing. Your main weapon setup is a gun with the glass marble bullets or giant bullet if you're lazy and don't want to go through a quest line. Your main attack is rapid fire which is a hold down skill. Every 5 seconds cast brain scrambler and every 45 seconds cast death trigger. You can also cast target lock every 30 seconds if you aren't saving it for iframe. Power banner should also be casted off cooldown if you have it. Para targeting can also be used to increase damage and to refresh firing orders. Corsairs have two iframes, Nautilus Assault and Target Lock. They also have three skills that give Super Stance, 8 Legs Easton while holding the down arrow, Bullet Barrage, and Pirate's Banner's Jump Animation. The five hypers you must have are all three on Brain Scrambler, Rapid Fire Reinforce, and for the last point you can either put it on Rapid Fire Boss Rush or Add Range. Here is the general order for the full 3 minute burst. Epic Adventure, Maple Goddess's Blessing, Pirate Banner, Overdrive, Whaler's Potion, Terms and Condition, Oz Ring, Nautilus Assault, Death Trigger, Brain Scrambler, Bullet Barrage, and Cancel for Brain Scrambler again. Then you have your 1.5 minute half burst which includes Overdrive, Terms and Conditions, Death Trigger, Brain Scrambler, Bullet Barrage, and Cancel again for Brain Scrambler. Training. Your main spammable attack is 8 legs Easton and you place your summons down for the largest map coverage. If you put broadside ships close to each other with the firing orders, they will both attack where the firing order is. Depending on the map, you can either place one ship out of the firing order's range or not use firing orders altogether. Target lock and death trigger should be casted off cooldown or during loot cycles. Bullet barrage can be used periodically for lazy training but keep in mind you can't summon or use other attacks while using this. Nautilus strike and ugly bomb can also be casted off cooldown if you want. Your training hypers are all three on brain scrambler and double down in hand and saving grace. The next obvious question is, what nodes should I use, level, or prioritize? Well, this next video will go over and provide a general guideline and break down what nodes you should use and level first for training and bossing.